Yeah, no. Um, workout today. We're going to have a general warm up. We're going to practice the movements, especially in the mind makers. But the make on itself is six rounds every four minutes on the minute, so 24 minutes of work in total. And eat every four minutes, we need to fit 30 jumping lunges. Okay, uh, we'll, we'll go through the movement, don't worry. So every four minutes will be 30 jumping lunges, 50 double unders, or 60 jumping jacks, or 70 single unders, or, okay, and 10 man makers. Okay, I'm sorry, that's what they're called. Uh, they're very hard, it's a very hard movement. Okay, can Imagine what woman maker could be if man make it so hard. So <clears throat> um, we're gonna go through the general warm up first, which is a 45 seconds work, 15 seconds rest for six minutes. So we just have a little uh, time to transition to the next one. Mainly, these movements are to prepare us for um, the man makers. Okay, so plank shoulder taps on the ground. So, in a plank position, trying to stay as steady as possible, tap, doesn't matter how many we do, as long as we keep that good plank for 45 seconds. From rack squat, with one dumbbell, okay, so you're gonna have your dumbbell or your kettlebell in the front rack, and squats. When we go again in the second round, you're gonna have to do it on the other shoulder, okay. And then pike push-ups. So, bum up in the air, head down, top of your head on the ground, and stretch with your arms straight. Okay, so 45 or 15 rest. Just gonna set the clock, and we're then ready to go. We only need a dumbbell or a weight, a kettlebell, um, to, for the front rack squats. So six rounds, 45 work, 15 rest. Starting in 10 seconds. Plank shoulder taps. And hold. Good. Doesn't exactly matter, guys, how many we do. Okay, just try to get each rep, really focus, raise the core, control the movement to your shoulder, and then back down. Okay. Now we go into the front rack squat. So one dumbbell on your shoulder. Imagine you have to do a thruster, but you don't actually do it, okay? So you need to keep it nice and upright. Good. No need to do a million, we're gonna do loads of legs anyway. Just keep steadily going. Good. Rest and pike push ups are coming. Oh, it was so cold in here. Okay. Come on, head through. And take your time to stretch at the top. Thank you. 
Yes. Okay, round one, sort it. Shake your arms, because we're going into shoulder tops again. Get ready. And let's start. And Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Now the same weight, other shoulder for squats. Break it up. And let's go. Get maybe another one and rest. And some bikes. Okay, three, two, one. Start. Very good. This is our general warm up done. We are now going to have a look at what the movements are. So, jumping, some jumping lunges, sorry, jumping lunges. So, ideally, a jumping lunge goes from knee to the ground, okay, coming up explosively, swap, knee. Swap, knee, swap, knee. Okay? Now, if you don't feel you're ready to try it, we can start with a few normal lunges, which is also a scaled option, and then we can have a go. Okay? So, let's try with four normal lunges. Come on, guys. Lunges. And once we've done four, we try to do four jumping ones. You don't have to use them in the workout, but give it a go. So, knee, swap, knee, swap, knee, swap. Okay, so that's jumping lunges sorted or lunges if you need to scale it. Double unders and jumping jacks. Hard to try it if you're home, if you don't have space, obviously don't do it. So you would need to do jumping jacks. And now the man makers. So a man maker is, so one rep is a push up, two renegade rows, and a cluster. So let's see it. In. 
Don't worry if you don't have to. I'll ex we'll go and, and uh, see we'll down the option. So, man, make it. First shot. One, two, three. Okay. Does that make sense? Okay, so do you have two dumbbells of the same weight? Do you want to use this? <laughs> so is it better to go? I've got two at eight or one at fifteen. So uh, so go with eight. Okay. So the total weight is the same enough, but you do it, you know, in a in a good way, like in a proper way. So if you have one dumbbell, guys, so first of all, first of all, let's make sure that we know the order of it. Okay? So again, push up. One, two, squat clean and thrust. Okay? Right. Let's see it. Show me what you got. Very good. So squat clean and thrust are perfect. Well done. Very good. So it's a it's really a complex. It's, a, it's just as if we were going to do like a bear complex or something like that. So different movements make one rep. That's really good. So if you have only one weight, um, for you, Sarah, or in general, somebody else is going to do this workout after, you do it exactly the same way. Okay? It's gonna, since it's going to be six rounds, you're going to alternate the hand that works. Okay? So one round, you'll always use your right hand, okay? And the left hand will be just a shoulder tap, okay? Just empty, coming up. But it's the same thing. Okay, so you do your push up. One, two, and then your clean and thrust. Okay? And then the other round, uh, you'll do. So, not every single rep, because that's going to be a bit messy. So, you're just going to do one, a whole round, 10 reps with one arm, a whole round, 10 reps with the other arm, and so on. If you have to, there's no problem. You don't have to, so you always work both hands. Questions? Val, can you do jumping squats instead of jumping lunges? Because it's a bit slippy in here and I don't have shoes on. Yeah, of course. Okay. Squat jumps, yeah, that's... Is that okay? Yeah. Don't want to wear shoes in the house. No, 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 no. Squat jumps are okay. Um, you want to have a little bit of a rest between between you go into the next one. So, so should you maybe give yourself thirty seconds rest? Yeah. So, um, I'll be honest. I don't know how long it's going to take to do ten man makers. It's probably um, been. I, I, I honestly don't even know what well, I'm talking about. <laughs> okay. So, <clears throat> I reckon we should always get, we should always aim to get, as you said, 20, 30 seconds of rest so we can go into the next round. Uh, yeah. Nice and strong. Okay. Yeah. Maybe in the can last you, of rounds. Can you tell us when we've got one minute left? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, um, assuming oh, yeah. that see, well, I will, but also yeah. in case there is a clock out there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, think about any other question that you can have that you may think of when I set the clock for six rounds of four minutes of work. 
Uh, one more day. Four minutes of work. And green zero seconds of rest. As usual, we need to earn our rest. Six times, 24 minutes at most, starting with 30 jumping lunges. Everybody ready? Okay, 10 seconds. Then jumping jacks or skipping. That's almost a minute to go. Okay. Well, ten seconds. Lunges in three, two, one.
one, guys. Two and a half minutes to complete this round. Forty seconds, and maybe squeeze another couple in. Two minutes, come on.
We still got 45 seconds. This is the good news. Bad news, never halfway. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, let's go. Well done guys, come on. One and a half minutes to go. Come on. Forty seconds. Round five coming. Get ready. Jumping one, just hold on, just ready in three, 
two, one, go. On Sarah, let's go. So a minute, the round set. Keep working on that. Come on, it's not easy. Seconds, and that'll be our last round. <clears throat> Catch your breath. Ready for jumping on this. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, sir. Last round. Do your best. Oh, oh, my legs. Huh. 
Two and a half minutes, come on. One minute. We don't need to rest for the next one. So one be in the next one. Well done, guys. Time. Well, can't say it was easy for me. Maybe for you guys. Definitely struggled with that. Okay, let's get a minute to cool. Well, not really to cool down, just to rest a little bit. And then we get a couple of stretches done. Everybody feeling okay? Okay. Start nice and easy. Feet straight, uh, sorry, right straight, feet pointing up, knees together. Try to squeeze your knees down on the ground as much as you can. And squeeze your quads a tiny bit to make it even better. And then, let's grab our toes. 45 seconds here.
Let's relax your abs and back. Every breath, try to go a little deeper. We've got a few seconds to go. Okay. Relax. As wide as you can get. That's it for me. <laughs> Try not to let your toes coming in this way. Okay, so we need them out. Pointing out or up at least. And we go from both hands on one side. Two, one, go. Okay, in the middle, both hands down here. And um, other leg. A bit longer, five seconds. Okay, rest one more and then you're free. So, we go on the ground this way. So, we have white ish legs. Heels on the ground if possible, so not this way, but this way. Okay, and then I'll show you from the front. From here, one leg goes straight out. If possible. Okay. Elbows down on the ground and push your bum back the way. Okay. So basically with your elbows, try to push the floor so that you gently um, shift your bum back. Ten seconds. Okay, very, very gently bring the leg in. Okay, and we get ready for the other side. So, slowly. Ready, play out, elbows down, and push back. Let's go.
Keep going. Five. And gently rest, guys. Well done. Well done. I really have to say that was a hard workout. Yeah, that was a hard one. Yeah. Whew. Never mind. Oh, well, guys, nice to see you all. Have a good